begin. Um, let's begin with the uh, steps on how to register for Show B. So please um, watch carefully and follow the instructions as I've uh, later on I'll be remodifying it to give you where I was clicking and how to go about doing the steps. Okay, the first thing we're going to do is going to sign up free. So I'm going to come to the website. I'm going to click on sign up free. Then it's going to uh, ask me if I'm a teacher or I'm a student. So in this case, since you're registering as my student, we're going to select I'm a student. So when we click on this link, uh, the sign up page is going to pop up, which is um, you're going to enter the class code. Uh, this class code, I'll be, uh, I'll be giving it to you on your on your e-learning platform, which you're going to be entering on this portion. Let's say, for example, like uh, this video was prepared for the N plus class. Uh, so those for those who are doing MCITP, you will need to get your your class code from your online platform. So let's say, for example, with a uh, class code for N plus, it's um, K eight V L B. Now this is a class code for N plus class. So all you need to do is to enter the class code. You put in your your first name and your you put in your you select a username. Uh, let's say for example, my name is John, and it says John is taking. Let me say one. So one is taking two. John twelve is taking three. John three is taking four. John four is taking. Uh, let's put on the score. Okay, so um, all we need to do is that when you're signing up, you want to put a name until it says that name is available, then you know the username is correct. Then after that, you need to put in your first name, John, Peter, and you need to put a password here. Let's say, for example, mine is Monday, and mine is Monday. Now, you want to put a very strong password just in case uh, somebody tried to hack into your account. And of course, you need to come in and type in your email address. Now, when this is done, all you need to do is to click on sign up. Are we together? Okay, click on sign up. Now, after you've clicked on sign up, of course, the page is going to somehow kind of disappear, but it's actually working. So it's going to somehow disappear. I'm going to take this off and I'm going to just click on sign up. Um, okay, so the group code is required. Um, okay, I'm just going to skip this. So I'm going to go back to Show B, but um, I'm I'm trying to skip this because I don't want to go to, I don't want to go through the registration. So I don't want to have on S3 people registering on that platform. So all you need to do when you click on Sign Up, you cannot come back to Show B. You can come back to the home page uh, if it doesn't take you to the login page. Then you come in here and click on Sign In. So in this case, since I've registered earlier on before, I'm going to sign in now. And this is my pass, my username, uh, Sam at iCloud. I'm actually registered as a student in this case. I'm going to enter my password and I'm going to click on sign in. Um, not now. So when you sign in, it's going to bring you up to this page. Now, because you earlier on, uh, uh, typed in the the class code, you will automatically be registered on this class, which is Certificate in Network Technician. For those of you who are doing N+, but the students who are doing MCITP, you will see the MCITP uh, class here. So what the students would need to do now, you notice here I've assigned one assignment to you, which is N+. Uh, those students who are doing uh, MCITP, you will see your 70-413 assignment here as well. So I'm going to click on Final Assignments, and um, it's going to come up. Okay, um, just a minute. Okay, normally um, when you finish clicking on that, you get my files. It's going to show up my files, and this is the assignment which you need to download. So all you need to do is to click on this link, and of course a separate browser will open or in some scenarios, it will actually download the assignment. So in the case of some of you which your browser actually opens the link, all you need to do is to scroll down and you come to the um, to the PDF uh, palette and you click on save and you can save it on your desktop or give it a name and save it whichever location you want. When that is done, 
cancel close the tab then first for example after your assignment has been done all you need to do is to come back again and sign in and you click on add files so let's say I'm done with my assignment and and this is actually my assignment let's say this picture is actually my assignment so what I'm going to do I'm going to click on this picture and I'm going to click on choose and that is it it's going to upload the picture onto my platform and that is all when your assignment is done and you're finished uh, um, setting up your files your pages are intact and everything it's uh, it's ready all you need to do is to click on the add button you upload the files and it will be here and you can sign out uh, your trainer will automatically get the notifications when assignment has been submitted so guys that is all for now um, any more questions, you can always send me an email on the e-learning platform. Thank you very much.